Hello, good evening. Hello. Good evening. Hello. We're going to start, well, our class, right? Uh, but we're going to wait for at least two more people because we only have three students, right? Let's wait for them. With today's video conference number eight. Can you see my computer? Yes. Vamos a esperar por los compañeros un minuto o dos minutos a lo máximo y luego comenzamos. Ok. Okay, so we have seven students now. We are going to start with the class. I remember we are going to do the National English for Work program, a beginner module. And well, we will continue here uh, with unit number two. It is, hello. Can you please read number one? Describe my job position and the activities that I perform every day at work. Very good, very good. Describe my job position. Repeat, describe. De describe. Very good. Let's continue here. Please read for me number two, Ivan Ernesto. Okay, describe a uh, power daily run time of work. Okay, describe a partner's daily routine at work. Very good. Hi, nice. Jessica. Okay. Nice to see you. Jessica, nice. do number three. Okay, ask, ask parents question about the daily, daily routines and and he daily routine and he answers about my routine. Very good. And give answers about my routine. Give. Repeat. Give. 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 Uh, give. Go. Yes. Go. Give. Repeat. Give. Give. Excellent. Thank you so much. And Carolina, do number four, please. Okay. As part of the question about some else daily routines and say what they do it don't. What they do or don't. Very good. Thank you so much, Carolina. Now this is video conferencia numero ocho, daily routines, activities, practice. Right? That's what we're going to do. We're going to practice with 
the simple present in our daily routines, okay? So, what is a daily routine? A daily routine is what we do every day, right? For example, in my house, in my house, the first thing that I do in the morning is I wake up at 6 a.m. I wake up at 6 a.m. After that, I take a shower. After I take a shower, I prepare my food, my breakfast. At 7 a.m., I eat my breakfast. At 7.30, right, I start my work. Okay. That's my routine in my house in the morning. In my workplace, at 7.30 a.m., I start teaching English. Okay. At 10 a.m., I have a break. At 12, I have lunch. At 12.30, yes, at 12.30, I have lunch. And then I start again at 6 p.m. Okay, so that is a routine, right? To say what you do in your work. You can also say at 8, at 8 a.m., I check my email. Do you check your email? Do you check your email? Yes, I do check my email every day. I also, ah, I drink coffee at 7 a.m. in my work because I work from home, so it's the same, right? So I drink coffee, right? Do you, what do you do every day in your work, Joanna? In my work? Yes, in your work. I, in all day? Yeah. I prepare the documents. I, I, I send, I send electromestic. Okay. I send electrodomestic. Very good. I said, I send electrodomesticos would be appliances. We're going, I am going to write it here for you. Appliances. Okay, that would be the TV, the, the blender, the radio, those are appliances, okay? Electronic appliances, it's in the chat, okay? I send the appliances, very good. Now, we are going to start here with one thing, right? First, well, I have many people now, I am going to call the attendance, Vamos a pasar la asistencia y aquí tenemos varios. Right. Give me a moment. I have here Ana Daisy Fuentes Villegas. Present. Brenda Iris Escamilla Pérez. Present. Carlos Roberto García Ramírez. Present. Thank you so much. Eh, Carolina Yamilet Hernández Landa Verde. Present. Thank you. Eh, Claudia Ivette Samayo. Present. Denis Fernando, eh, Denis Fernando Flamenco Norasco. Emerson Adalberto Guevara Ortez. Heriberto Antonio Alas Mengiba. Present. Iris Elizabeth Salazar de Flores. Okay. Iván Ernesto Díaz. Present. Jessica Rosmedio Olmedo Fuentes. Present. Julio Carlos Martínez. Present. Karina Melissa Estrada Aldana. Present. Milton Linares Molina. Nelson Iván Alfaro Flores. Present. 
Nimian Elizabeth León de Estrada. Present. Dilma Beatriz Reyes Márquez. Jenny Carolina Martínez Alvarado. Present. And Joana Beatriz Orellana Severo. Present. Thank you so much. Now, we are going to continue working here. Los mencioné a todos, sí. Sí. Bueno, asumo que sí. Let's go ahead and work right now with activities that we do in our workplace, okay? Now, we have a, our activities, for example, here. Right? It says on our book, share your activities to some classmates, right? And we're going to working groups, right? And try to share the information that we do every day, right? Activities I do. At the beginning of the class, I told you the activities I do, right? In my workplace, uh, at, I check my email at 7.45 a.m. That's what I do, right? And number two, I plan the classes for the next day at 1 p.m. That's what I do in my workplace. Number three, what do I do? Oh, I teach English at 8 a.m. I have meetings with my boss at 2 p.m. every day. And the last one, right? I finish my, sorry, I finish my work at 10, 15 p.m. This is for me. These are the activities that I do, right? Now, the question that you can ask to someone here is the following. You can ask them, what are some activities you do every day? What are some activities that you do every day? For example, Wendy makes inventory. Alfonso drinks coffee in the morning. Like this is an example of a question. Ustedes pueden hacerle esta pregunta a su compañero, okay? What are some activities you do every day? They can say this. If you ask me, Sylvia, what are some activities that you do every day? I will answer, oh, I check my email at 7.45, right? Then you will write, Sylvia checks her email at 7.45 a.m. This is the question. These are the answers. Okay. All of you are going to write activities I do. Right? After that, you are going to ask the question, what are some activities you do every day? Or you can say also, you can ask another question also, you can ask, What do you do at work every day? What do you do at work every day? Las dos preguntas preguntan lo mismo, right? So I can ask eh, Heriberto, what are some activities you do every day? Tell me one, one activity.
Okay. Um, I check my email. Uh, 7 a.m. Okay. Tell me another one because check email is there. Tell me another. One. Tell me something new. I check the. I check the information in in system. Ediberto checks the information in the system every day or once a day, once a week. Every day. Every day. Okay. Look at this. Right. He told me. <laughs> I check the information in the system every day. But what I'm going to do is that I am going to write, Heriberto checks the information in the system every day. Okay, ya es un third party, okay? Ya es una third person singular. Por eso es que todos los verbos van a cambiar. Okay? Do we understand this part? ¿Entendemos esta parte? Yes? yes? Or no? Yes. 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 Joanna yes. says yes. Okay. Edie says yes. Okay. First, so right now what you're going to do is that each one of you on your book, this activity is on your book. Right. Go to your book, please. And on your book, you are going to check. Ya le voy a decir qué página van a revisar para que ahí lo escriban y ya lo tengan listo. Okay. You are going to check right now, page. Page, 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 page. Jesus Christ. Page 20. Okay. In the página 20, page 20, you will see activities I do. I let's explain. Okay. I think we can have two minutes to write the activities. Individually. After that, we are going to share the answer. Tell me if you have questions, if you don't know what to say or how to say it, right? Tell us. Did you finish, Alberto? Almost? Perdón, me había levantado. <laughs> okay.
Tell me if you finish or if you have questions. Si no, ya terminaron o tienen preguntas, digan. Ahorita solo estamos haciendo la parte donde dice activities I do. Solamente esa. Activities I do. Let's see. Finished. Very good, Joanna. Thank you so much. What about the others? Como hombre de más? Only Joanna? Sorry, teacher. Uh, how do you say the archivos in English? Files. Files, yeah. Files. Yeah. Don't worry. Let me let me put it in the chat so everyone can see that. Okay. Thank you. Files. Archivos. Files. Anybody else with a question? Yo. Yes, Nimia. Eh, ¿Cómo se o cómo se escribe cotizaciones? Hacer cotizaciones. Hacer cotizaciones. Ooh. What do you do in your work? Um, salt woman. You are a sales woman, okay? And your job is. Lo que haces es hacer cotizaciones. That's it. Okay. All right. Let me put it in the chat, okay? What you do is that I'm good. I make quotes. I make quotes. Quotes, cotizaciones. Quotes. Okay, teacher. You're welcome. Another one with a question. No questions? Okay, we have another question here. 
What do you do? Yeah. Thank you, Jenny. ¿Qué es lo que hace, Brenda? Registrar facturas, cheques. Okay, you are an accountant, right? Mm -hmm. Conciliaciones okay. bancarias. Okay, and what is the definition of bookkeeper? Bookkeeper, do you remember the definition of bookkeeper? Bookkeeper. We work uh, on Monday with the definition of bookkeeper, human resource specialist, mm -hmm. digital. Okay, what is bookkeeper? Yes, bookkeeper. Bookkeeper, bookkeeper is uh -huh. person that that keeps control of financial of company. Okay, keeps track of financial accounts. Así se dice lo que usted hace todos los días. Right? Cuando usted dice, thank you, Julio, thank you, uh, Joanna. Cuando dice, registrar contabilidad de los clientes. You keep track of financial accounts of your clients. Right? Of your clients. Se dice companies porque hay contadores o bookkeepers that they do it for companies. But if you do it for a person or persons, you're going to do with clients. Okay. ¿Ya encontró la, la, la definición, Brenda? No, ahorita la busco. Okay. It's on page 19. Page 19. Page 19. Okay, did you finish? ¿Ya terminaron? Yes. Yes, ni me decía Karina. Did you finish, Karina? Karina no, Melissa Estrada. No, no teacher, estoy teniendo problemas con el internet y me saca cada momentito. Estoy oh. perdida. Sí. <laughs> No sé qué están haciendo. We are writing the activities that we do every day in our workplace. Mm -hmm. okay. Carolina, do you finish? Did Carolina? Eh, yo eh, estoy terminando ya, pero ya tengo eh, seis actividades. Oh, re, enough, re enough. That ya is no. enough, enough. Ah, okay. With two, three, it's fine. Okay. okay. Claudia Beth, Julio, yes. ¿Ya tienen por lo menos tres? Yes, ready. Yes, very good. So, what are yes, we going teacher. to do now? Very good, thank you. What are we going to do now? We're going to share with this question, what are some activities you do every day or what do you do at work every day? Cualquiera de las dos pueden utilizar. Okay, eso es lo que le van a preguntar a sus compañeros, okay? Cuando ella le diga, eh, Brenda le diga, I keep track of financial accounts of companies, usted lo escribe, right? But you're going to write, Brenda keeps track of financial accounts of companies, right? Of clients. Usted lo va a escribir en third person singular, right? That's what we're going to do at this moment. Is that clear what we're going to do? Is it clear? Yes. Yes, yes. Eliberto says yes. What about the others? Is it clear what we're going to do? Thank you, Marina. Hello, guys. Hi, I need an answer. Necesito una respuesta, por favor. ¿Entiende lo que vamos a hacer en el equipo? Solo Eliberto me entendía. Okay, yes. Jessica, Carolina dice que sí. What about the others? Yes. Que vamos a trabajar? Sí, okay. Yes, Let's continue then. We're going to work in groups of three right now. Okay, vamos a trabajar en grupo de tres para que puedan eh, recopilar información de sus compañeros. Después de cuatro minutos, okay, van a cambiar automáticamente con otros compañeros. ¿Qué tal de escribir la información? que eh, fue. Let's go ahead and do that. 
Let's go. Please select your groups. Karina? Uh, what are some activities you do every day? Um, what? No, is, what are some activities you do every day? Equal. No la voy a copiar después porque yo solo, solo la respuesta tengo. What do you do at work every day? Copia las Pero preguntas dos ahorita, por favor. Ok. Ahorita los por acá. What? Uh, okay. Activity. Thank you, Julio Carlos. You do everything. Okay. What do you do at work? Work every day. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Pueden hacer cualquiera de los dos, correcto, teacher? Exacto. Okay. Cuando ustedes se sientan más cómodos, ¿Quieren? esa utilizan. ¿Quieren? Les, les pregunto y... Yeah. Ok. Ok. Heriberto, what do you do at the board every day? Ok. Sometimes I have days, some reports every week. Sí, wake up. Ajá, todas las actividades que se uh -huh. hacen, pienso yo durante el día, por eso les decía que yo había repartido desde que me levanto, que son las actividades en casa y las otras las actividades ya cuando estoy en el trabajo. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Eh, para tomar un baño, le faltó el take. I take a shower. Ah, para tomar el baño. Uh -huh. Take a shower. I, I take a shower. Uh -huh. Take a shower. Take a shower. Ok. Uh -huh. Ok. Esas serían las que yo tengo. Ok. And you, Brenda. Yo puse, I wake up at 6 a.m. I take a shower at 6, 6 y 15, no sé cómo, 6, 15 y entro yo. I go to my work, then I have my breakfast. I check my email at 8, 15 a.m. I work every day at 7 p.m. Uh, I study English at 8 p.m. I sleep at 11 p.m. Okay. So I wake up at. Uh, remember, remember that you just have a few time to write some of the answers. Solamente tienen cuatro minutos para compartir su respuesta porque después se les va a unir alguien más. 
¿ok? Así como Carolina se fue para otro grupo, así tienen que ir compartiendo. Si se okay. tardan mucho, no van a compartir lo que tienen de las tres. ¿Ok? Ok. Yes. Ok. My uh, activities, I wake up at 5 a.m. Later, I go to the bathroom. Usually, I take a shower around at... Uh, no sé ustedes. Bueno, en mi caso yo solo hice cuatro principales yeah, diarios okay. en trabajo. Mm -hmm. Ok. ¿Cómo tú? Carolina. Yo. Carolina. Eh, Hola. No, ok. Una cosa, no las compartan todas. Compartan una, dos o tres, porque solo tienen cuatro minutos. A los cuatro okay. minutos empiezan a cambiar y van a estar por donde más y no van a tener la información. Ah, okay, okay. Sí. Entonces, eh, si quieren les digo yo una de casa y dos de trabajo. Okay. Okay, Carolina. What are the, some I... activities do you do every day? Uh -huh. I take a shower at uh, six, six city. Ay, es que no sé cómo se dice treinta. Terry. Terry. Ah, Terry. Okay. Entonces, I take a shower at 6.30 a.m. A.m., perdón. Y luego, I go to work at 6.30 a.m. I check the days, agents, and emails. What is agents? Perdón. What is agents? Eh, o sea, yo chequeo, chequeo la, la agenda del día y los emails. Ok, agenda. Repeat, agenda. Ag ah, agenda. Agenda. Ah, okay. Okay. Ah, entonces, Ahora que, uh -huh. Agenda. Ahora que comparta alguien más, por favor. Ajá. Yo, Carolina, okay. haz Karina o haz Jessica. Y usted escribe también las que ellos le van a compartir. Uh -huh. Haz the question, Carolina, tu Karina. Hágale la pregunta a Karina. Activity, activity I do every day? No. Hágale no. la pregunta. La misma que le hizo Nelson a usted, esa le va a hacer usted a Karina. Tiene como 10 segundos para hacerle esa pregunta. Ok. Es que eso escuché yo que me dijo, <ríe> que me dijo Nelson. Eh, no. 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 Mm. Esta fue la pregunta que él compartió. Que, que él le preguntó. Le hizo una de estas dos. Les mencioné, van a hacer una de estas dos preguntas para que la, ah. la persona les pregunte. Ajá. Él le hizo la número uno. What are some okay. activities you do every day? Ah, ok. Usted puede hacer cualquiera de las dos. Cualquiera de las dos. What do you do at work every day? Um, I am determined determin the cost for the Everyone finish? Yeah? Finish. Okay, very good. Yes. You will go to another place, okay? Okay. Number two. Ana Daisy, share your answers with Heriberto, please. Okay, Heriberto. Yes. Eh, yo tenía Jenny, Carlos. No, share your information with Heriberto. Your information. Ana Daisy. 
What? Hi. What do you What do you do at work every day? Hi, Heriberto. <laughs> Sorry. What? <laughs> um. I run. I run and in insurance insurance policies check. I keep a check on on back loan. I keep a check on customers banking activities. Repeat, please, again. I keep a check on customer, clientes, customer, bank, yes. banking activities. Okay. I keep a check on back loan. I check. Loan. Se escribe W E I N G H. W E I G H. Can you do it in English, please? The alphabet. Uh, w, w, I, G, H. Again, W, W, E, I, G. H. Very good. Excellent. Ok. Exacto. Es que me teacher, tengo llamada. Dele. Emerson. Buenas noches. Hola. Emerson Adalberto. Buenas noches. Are you, are you here? Are you sharing with your classmates? ¿Está compartiendo con sus compañeros, Emerson? Sí, sí, solo que este, solo necesito, si me puede, para hacer una llamada, porque todavía estoy en el trabajo. Oh, ok, ok. Claudia, I will send you with another group, ok. Bueno, ya vamos a terminar la verdad. Ok, ya terminó, ya tiene por lo menos dos o tres. Dos. Dos. Ok. Eh, Ticha, ¿cómo se dice plataforma? Platform. 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 Ok, le van a recibir la notificación de que ya terminamos, tienen todavía un minuto. Ok. 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 Now, I want you to share with me, right, what you collected from your class. What is the information you collected from them, right? For example, I collected information from, uh, from Juanita. Juanita checks her email every day at 10 a.m. Right? That's what you're going to do. You are going to read what you get from your classmates, not your information, okay? Your classmates' information. Van a leer la información de sus compañeros, no la de ustedes. Recuerden, hay que utilizar simple present, right? And these are activities that we do every day. These are routines, right? So we need to use the rule of S. Vamos a utilizar la regla de la S que vimos ayer. Let's start with Mr. Heriberto. Tell me two sentences from different... Okay. Johanna, she wakes up at 5 a.m. Johanna wakes up at 5 a.m. Just like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. 
Joanna wakes up at uh, 5 a.m. And Brenda takes her shower at 6 15 a.m. At 6 15 a.m. At 6 15 a.m. Okay, very good. Very good. Now, in, in, teacher, in this case, Eh, siempre será she takes her shower o she takes her bath shower is from, usually in El Salvador all of us we only have like like a shower right that okay. we see and the, the water comes out a bath is when you have a bath like in the movies like, like it is like a, a place where you put water and then you stay there with with soap right so it's different okay Un baño, okay. con bañera, bath, o un shower, like, con una regadera. Usually in El Salvador, un guacalazo. Un guacalazo. <laughs> un guacalazo is take a shower too. Okay. <laughs> okay, good. Now, Heriberto, choose another person. Okay. Um, um, Johanna. Johanna. Two sentences, Johanna, from different people. Okay. Carlos makes Excel spreadsheet. <clears throat> mm -hmm. And Brenda takes a shower at six and a quarter. Six, okay. Six and a quarter. Very good. Very good. Spreadsheets. Okay, very good. Now we have two. Johanna, choose another person. La permito. Jenny. Jenny. Jenny Carolina. Hi. Hmm? Plus activity. Yeah. Two activity. Different people. It is. It is. It is check her email at 8.20 a.m. Okay. It is checks. 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 Mm -hmm. um, Daisy mm -hmm. get a check a consument banking activities. Minion okay. call the client every day. Okay, only two. Only two. Only two. Huh? No. Mm -hmm. Write the second sentence that you say, please. Write the second sentence in the chat. La segunda oración, escribe en el chat, por favor. La segunda oración. Sí, la segunda que dijo. And in the meantime, please choose another person. Jenny, choose another person. Another uh, person, Julio. Julio, okay, Julio. Y escribe la oración en el chat, por favor. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Um, Heriberto, uh, he create some report a week. Mm -hmm. uh, Ivan, he wait truck in Sky every day. Okay, um, but remember, only two, only two. But you're going to say, Heriberto creates. You're not going to say, Heriberto he. Okay, porque si dice, Heriberto he, okay. está poniendo doble sujeto, y eso no lo vamos a hacer. Recuerda lo que dijimos okay. el martes. Okay, Heriberto creates. Bla, bla, bla. Right. Okay. Very good. Now, choose another person, Juan Carlos. Mm. Uh, Nimian. Nimian. Hi, Nimian. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> um, eh, mi compañero fue eh, Jenny, Carlos, Ana Daisy. Bueno, fueron varios. <laughs> okay, but you're going to tell me two only. Okay. Um, eh, Jenny. Quiero ver. 
Jenny eh, Check Student Static at Change Morning. Ay, no sé. Ok, don't worry, don't worry. Say it again. Esa sería la actividad. Digo otra. No, repeat, repeat, please. Ah, ok. Uh, Jenny eh, Check Student Static at 10 Morning. At 10 in the morning. Ok, very good. Write the sentence in the chat, please. Ok, very good. Okay. Tell me another sentence. One more, one more. Una más. Ok. Una más, um, me voy a decir dos. Ajá. Eh, eh, Mark attendance at seven o'clock. Who? ¿Quién hace eso? Who, who does that? ¿Quién hace eso? O solo le pregunto Carlos, a Jenny. Carlos. A Carlos. ¿A Carlos? Carlos, otro. Carlos, Mark attendance at seven o'clock. Very good. Thank you so much. Excellent. Carlos Merck's attendance at 7 o'clock. When we say, mis compañeros fueron, my classmates were Polanito, Sutanito, and Chanito, right? My, my classmates were. If it's only one, my classmate was. Right? Iris, keep a check a customer making activities. Okay. It will be Iris. Track of customers, customers, bank activities. Okay. Bank activities. Very good. Now I need one volunteer. Veamos un voluntario para esta actividad. Voluntario. He marks attenders. Carlos. Very good. Okay, Joanna. Very good. I appreciate it. So, Joanna. Huh? Usted ya pasó. Ah, okay. And, pero me gusta esa actitud. Muy buena. Another volunteer. Teacher. Jessica. Teacher, it's mm -hmm. yours. Hmm? Jessica. Okay, and then Karina, right? Very good. Jessica. Okay, so Melissa writes the reports and Melissa the checks the information in the morning. In the morning, very good. Thank you so much. Who else raised her hand? ¿Quién me levanta la mano? Okay, Karina. Go ahead, Karina. I'm sorry, teacher. ¿Qué le pasa? Yo tengo a mi perrita aquí. Que... Okay. Iris. Uh -huh. She makes financial statement at okay. 11 a.m. Uh -huh. And she makes make report for CNR. Okay. Very good. Thank you so much. Remember not to repeat the, the subject twice. Okay. No repitan el sujeto dos veces. Si dicen Iris o dicen she, dicen Heriberto o dicen he, dicen Nelson o he. ¿Ok? Uno de los dos. Another volunteer? ¿Otro voluntario? No. Nobody wants to practice? Me, teacher. Ok, Iris. Go ahead, Iris. Karina determined information for the cost the new product and the night I am. The termins. The Look termins. at the chat. Yes, the termins. Very the good. The termins. Now we have a who look at my classmates were Eriberto and Ivan. Eriberto creates some reports a week. Ivan weighs trucks in a, in a scale. In a scale. And a scale. Very good. Brenda Iris, your example. Thank you, Iris. Excellent. Um, Carlos makes spreadsheets. 
Okay, spread chips. Chips. Spread chip. Hojas, hace hojas de cálculo. Yeah, it's okay. Another one? Y Joanna wake up at 5 a.m. Okay, very good. Joanna wakes up at 5 a.m. Very good. Spread chips. If you, if you say chips, son botes, como los que andan en el mar. Right, chips. Okay. okay. Now, we're going to continue with the next activity. Before we do that, right before the next activity that we're going to do, I want to explain to you something. Eh, les comentaba por el chat de WhatsApp que iban a recibir una información hoy. ¿Las recibieron de parte de Inglés Corporativo? No. Yes. Sí. Yes. Yes. Sí. Yes. Sí. Yes. Sí. Yes. Sí. Yes. Sí. Exactamente. De eso les quiero, les quiero hablar un poquito antes de que sigamos por si tienen un, alguna pregunta. Eh, les comento puntos importantes. Hoy iban ustedes a recibir eh, los correos eh, a recursos humanos y los WhatsApps a cada uno de ustedes también para que empiecen a enviar los documentos para la inscripción del siguiente módulo. Eso siempre se hace en la segunda semana de cada uno de los módulos que van a llevar. Porque eh, Insafor lo revisa y es un proceso un poquito largo porque tienen que ver que todo esté completo. Entonces, solamente para, para, para aclararles ¿verdad? la información, la fecha límite de la recepción de los documentos es el jueves 6 de mayo. Entonces, quiere decir que, bueno, de esta semana a la siguiente es la fecha límite. Eh, yo sé que la mayoría no envían ustedes la información, sino que la envían a sus recursos humanos, así que estén en pendientes. ¿Ok? Luego, eh, aparte de eso, eh, es, perdón. Vamos a recordar que los documentos son enviados por recursos humanos directamente, pero se les notifica a ustedes para que estén pendientes y apoyen con recursos humanos y no se les olvide enviarlos en el tiempo estipulado. Estos documentos eh, prácticamente lo que hacen es reservarles el cupo para el siguiente módulo, que es para el módulo Beginners 2. ¿verdad? Esto no quiere decir que van a pasar automáticamente, que hay que enviar los documentos. Esto significa que se les reserva un cupo. Va a depender de los resultados de la asistencia, que es el 80%, y el trabajo en la plataforma, que es el otro 80%, para que ustedes se les eh, otorgue la beca para el próximo modo. ¿Ok? También. Eh, otra cosa que es bien importante, se les envió el link para que evalúen a su, a su facilitador. En este caso soy yo. Les mandé mi nombre completo para que no vayan a... a a evaluar a otra Silvia, que es otra profesora también que está con nosotros, ¿verdad? Y así no nos equivoquemos. Y luego, bueno, prácticamente eh, se les iba a enviar hoy, si no han recibido esta encuesta, por favor, háganlo saber en el, en el chat de WhatsApp, ¿verdad? Pero revisen primero sus correos electrónicos, los que nos proporcionaron a inglés corporativo, eh, si han recibido o no la información, ¿ok? ¿Alguna pregunta? Sí, teacher, yo tengo una ¿Sí? pregunta. Dígame. Eh, quería preguntarle los documentos que vamos a entregar en el caso mío, como solo yo soy, eh, a mí me toca hacer todo como que yo fuera recursos humanos. <ríe> Entonces a mí me toca eh, pues llenar el formulario de, de uh -huh. inscripción y me toca hacer el, el, lo del otro de la ficha de datos de participantes. Okay. La pregunta es. Eh, siempre vamos a entregar los mismos documentos que se entregaron en el primódulo. Es decir, el DUI, el, el DUI NIT creo que también se entregaba. Eh, la planilla. La planilla. Y, ajá, la planilla, la, el registro de la firma registrada es la cuestión o, o firma de registro, que es la carta que da el empleador. ¿Verdad? Y estos dos formularios que, por cierto, yo ya los imprimí, los llené ahora. Ok, perfecto. Y la encuesta suya yo ya la hice, ya la mandé también. Gracias. Entonces, sí, los documentos usualmente son los mismos, no se piden documentos nuevos. Si se pidieran documentos nuevos, en ese caso le, se les va a notificar eh, con anticipación, ¿verdad? Para que los ah. preparen. Pero si sí, usualmente son los mismos documentos. La, la planilla, que es lo, una de las cosas eh, primordiales para para Insafor, ¿verdad? Y lo, los documentos normales que se les piden. Pero si okay. les van a pedir algo más, eh, les vamos a avisar lo antes posible. Sí. Ok. 
Gracias, Gracias Carolina, por su pregunta. Eh, ¿Otra pregunta por acá? ¿No? Sí, yo este, ¿Sí? ahí decía que tenía que ser la planilla del mes de marzo. Uh -huh. Sí, Entonces, siempre. Es la que se tiene que cancelar en abril. Ahí sí, de planillas le fallé. Permítame, déjeme escribir esa pregunta. Sí, Joana, así es. El seguro va un mes atrasado. Es decir, ajá. de que. Ajá, es decir, de, de que. De marzo no se ha pagado todavía. Eh, ajá, la de marzo eh, está por pagar. Es a finales. Es a finales. Pero allí es cuestión del empleador, porque no. el empleador la puede pagar antes. ¿Verdad? Eh, uh -huh. Tiene hasta finales del mes para pagarse, pero se puede pagar antes. Sí. Y, en, y ustedes en van es... a esperar hasta el 5 de mayo, ¿verdad? 6 de mayo es la, la fecha última. Okay. ok. Sí, pero en este caso para la planilla, lo que vamos a hacer ahorita les estoy escribiendo a ellos, que se comuniquen con usted, Joana, para que le expliquen bien cuál planilla va a ser y por qué va a ser así. ¿Ok? okay. Gracias, Ticho. Sí. Ah, perfecto, gracias. Y gracias, Carolina, por el apoyo. Eh, ¿Alguien más? Veo que hay otra mano. No. Brenda, ¿tiene alguna pregunta? No. No. Ah, ok. Veo la manita encendida. Ok, perfecto. Entonces. Y eso fue antes. Ah, ok. <ríe> Entonces, en este caso, ¿sí? Este, yo tengo una consulta. Y es que en mi caso he tenido problemas para entrar a la plataforma y hacer todas las tareas. Y el examen. Eh, recibí un correo de que tenía que esperarme 24 horas y me esperé y volví a ingresar y siempre me sigue dando el mismo problema. Entonces me dijeron de que me esperara más tiempo porque este ya hacía algo de la plataforma, pero voy a tener problemas porque como es el 80% de, de asistencia, uh -huh. actividades, entonces yo no he, he realizado ninguna actividad. No, en este caso, pero usted puso el correo que mandó para nosotros. Karina, yo veo que usted mandó el correo, déjeme ver, estradamelis.gmail.com ¿Ah? ¿Y la, qué, qué contraseña está poniendo? Es la misma la, para todos. Ajá, la que me enviaron ellos. ¿Qué, ¿Cuál le enviaron? Una, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. No le pone espacio al final, ni lo pone en mayúscula, ni nada. No. Entonces yo les, les hice de ahí de que si es problema mío al ingresar, uh -huh. a que me notifique para poder hacer las, las tareas. ¿Y cuándo, cuándo mandó eso hoy? Sí, porque hoy entré de nuevo, pero lo envié el sábado. El sábado que hablamos, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Vale, entonces lo voy a recordar mañana para que, oh, bueno, de otro ratito, ¿ok? Eh, ah, dice acá ya, eh, ¿cómo se llama? Eh, administración, que siempre es la misma documentación, pero actualizada, la que tienen que enviar, o sea, la que mencionó Carolina, pero actualizada, y que la va a enviar directamente Recursos Humanos a, a nosotros. Y que en el correo de Recursos Humanos está explicado lo de planilla, Joana. Que, y que sí, que para la reinscripción es la planilla de marzo 2021. Ok. Muy bien, Ya vamos a escribir lo suyo, Karina, entonces. Teacher, yo tengo una consulta, teacher. ¿Sí? ¿Sí? Teacher, yo tengo una consulta. ¿Sí? Dice que en mi correo solo me ha caído una, unas cuestiones que dicen, descargue importante los siguientes archivos de calendario en su sistema de calendario semanal, dice. Nada más solamente eso me ha caído, no me ha caído ningún link ni nada para poder responder este, la encuesta o algo así por el estilo. Ya revisó su, eso de, de, de lo que me acaba de mencionar, no sé qué es. Eh, tenemos es, su correo, Iván, Iván Eliasnet, arroba gmail.com. Iván Eliasnet, arroba gmail.com. Y sí me están cayendo notificaciones. Revise, por favor. Me están cayendo notificaciones de inglés corporativo. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Revise eh, donde tiene el me están spam. están cayendo correos. Spam. Okay. Uh -huh. A veces se va para ahí. Ah, oh, tengo siete, pero quiero ver. No, ninguno es de... 
Jimmy right. Martínez, Jimmy Martínez me escribió en ese entonces, pero fue, ya le digo, el lunes 12 de abril. Es el único que tengo en España. De ahí para allá no tengo nada más que eso. No recibió si nada hoy. de corporativo, confirmar la inscripción. No, en, en Gmail no, no he recibido nada. Ok, bye. Entonces le voy a informar Entonces, no a sé, ellos. No sé, si el, no sé si el enlace, no sé si el enlace para contestar la encuesta que le hacen a usted, eh, la van a mandar por medio de, de Gmail o la van a mandar al grupo de WhatsApp, no sé. Mm, no, lo sé, los mensajes se envían de forma eh, personal a cada uno de ustedes, no se envían en el grupo. Ok, perfecto. Entonces igual le espera. Uh -huh. Sí. Tiene su, su... ¿Tiene una pregunta. Sí. Ok. Sí. Sí. Eh, yo le consulté al... A mí me escribieron por WhatsApp el señor Rosa Rodríguez. Uh -huh. eh, igual pues yo le hice las consultas que no me han correspondido. Eh, una de las preguntas era que si la documentación no podía, la, es necesario entregarla solamente física o igual se podría hacer de manera virtual. Eso no me, la, no, no, no me correspondió y es una de las principales preguntas que tengo. ¿Que si la información se la puede enviar física o virtual? ¿Cómo la envió la primera vez? Solo la enviamos por correo o virtual. Ok. ¿Por qué la quiere enviar física? Lo que pasa es que en, el, en la misma forma que se eh, mandó, recordamos todas esas cuestiones, eh, nos dijo que lo enviáramos a, y nos mandó un email de, de la dirección. ¿Mm? O también se pueden enviar de la otra forma. Sí, se puede enviar de las dos formas. Si se la recibimos la primera vez eh, digital, se la podíamos enviar digital. Eh, con respecto a Iván Ernesto, mañana por la mañana van a verificar a primera hora qué es lo que okay. está pasando con su correo. ¿Ok? Perdón, este, le comento, este, fíjese que... Ya lo recibió. Aquí en, 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 en Gmail no me ha caído nada. No, no me ha caído nada, pero estoy revisando el WhatsApp. Uh -huh. Y tengo un WhatsApp de, eh, ya le digo, ¿quién? de Oscar Rodríguez. Ahí uh -huh. me ha mandado él lo, la información que le estaba pidiendo a usted. Así por que favor, ya la ajá. tengo por WhatsApp. Vale. Le confirmo. Porque ya estoy, ajá, ya estoy revisando bien y, y sí ya tengo esa información. Uh -huh. ya, me, ya tengo el link incluso, incluso de la encuesta. Ok. Muy ok. Bien. Gracias. Ok, perfecto. Dicen acá que se puede enviar la, la información... Física o virtual, como, como ustedes desean, lo importante es que las firmas y los sellos sean originales, porque lo Insafor va a rechazar los, los sellos y las firmas cuando son digitales, ¿verdad? Entonces, eh, hay que, lo pueden ver de, la, de las dos formas, como ustedes prefieran, Mimi. Pero sí, eh, sellos y firmas tienen que ser originales. Quiere decir que va a tener documento, lo va a firmar y lo puede escanear. De acuerdo, mil gracias. Ok, perfecto. Ok, muchas gracias. ¿Alguna otra pregunta? ¿No? Ok, seguimos entonces. The attendance, we're going to do the attendance very quick y luego seguimos con las actividades. ¿Está? Eh, Ana Daisy Fuentes Villegas. Present. Brenda Iris Escamilla Pérez. Present. Carlos Roberto García Ramírez. Present. Carolina Yamilet. Present. Claudia Ivet. Present. Denis Fernando. Emerson Adalberto. Emerson Adalberto. Se fue Emerson. Ok. 
Let's see, Heriberto Antonio Present. Alas. Present. Oh, Iris Elizabeth Salazar de Flores. Present. Okay. Iván Ernesto Elías. Present. Jessica Rosnero Elmedo Fuentes. Present. Julio Carlos Martínez. Present. Karina Melissa Estrada Aldana. Present. Milton Linares Molina. Y Nelson Iván Flores. Nimian Elizabeth León. Present. Vilma Beatriz Reyes. Jenny Carolina. Joana Present. Beatriz Orellana. Okay, very good. So now, Present. what we're going to do, right? Thank you very much. We're going to do an exercise right now that has to do with a practice here. Let me show you. One second. Okay, now I am going to share with you right now my screen, right? Do you see my screen now? Miren la compu, see? Yes. Okay, yes. very good. Now, we have here some activities. This is vocabulary that you can use for everyday activities if you happen to do those activities every day, right? We have the activities here, check email, Right. Drive a car. Eat breakfast. Exercise. Get up early. Go to school. Have dinner late. Play video games. See my friends. Sleep late. Talk on the phone. Watch television. Right. All of these, all of these, these are verbs. Check, drive, eat, exercise, get up, go, have, play, see, sleep, talk, and watch. All of them are uh, phrases that we can use every day. For example, I can say, I check email every day at 7 a.m. Right? I just need to put a subject and then a complement here to create a meaningful sentence, right? Then look at the example here. It says, write something you do and something you don't do each day of the week, right? For example, in my case, I have Monday. I get up early on Mondays, of course, it's a Monday, right? I don't sleep late on Mondays, right? So I have get up early. It's the phrase here, get up early. I sleep late, I sleep late. One is positive and one is negative because they are true. On Mondays, I get up early. I don't sleep late. On Tuesday, I can say on Tuesday, I, on Tuesday, I talk on the phone on Tuesdays. I don't exercise on Tuesdays, right? One positive, one negative, right? That's what we're going to do at this moment. 
we're going to put here. Let me put this is this is my information, right? My example. I talk on the phone with my mom on Tuesdays. On Tuesdays. This is positive, right? A negative is going to be, right? I don't exercise on Tuesdays. Right? So I am going to choose here. I am going to put it, oh, I put talk on the phone and I use exercise okay now i have the others to continue working here this is going to be based on what you do right let's go ahead and do this activity individually se entiende cómo lo, cómo vamos a trabajar eh, esta actividad right we have different different here uh, phrases that we can use right we're going to put them for each day of the week. Estos son los días de la semana, each day of the week. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Okay. Now, ¿se entiende lo que vamos a trabajar? Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. Hay algo que no han entendido y que le guste que le gustaría que lo repita. Eh, yes. O sea que cada uno de los que tenemos a la izquierda lo vamos a poner ahí a formar la oración. Exacto, exacto. Estos nos van a ayudar como vocabulario para no andar buscando más mm. vocabulario. Ya los tenemos acá y solo le vamos dando forma, ¿ok? Con nosotros. Hay, es va a ser el sujeto que vamos a usar en todos, porque son acerca de ustedes. ¿Ok? Hay. Ah, okay. ok, very good. Esta es pura okay. gramática de lo que vamos a Bien. ver ahorita. ¿Sí? Teacher. Teacher, la, digamos, la primera, la primera ejemplo que usted puso dice: A chal on the off, I the. Well, chal on the phone, why mom on Tuesday. No sé, no sé si se refiere que lo hace de una de ah oh, perdón dice my mom su mamá mi mamá dice yes I sí. talk with I talk on the phone with my mom eh, los Tuesday Tuesday los martes ajá okay. pero y la otra pregunta que dice negativa podría ser la misma o, o podemos ocupar otra no no, no, no deben no, ocupar no. otra van a ocupar otra si se fija en los dos son distintas no. por ejemplo uh -huh. el primero dijo Exacto. Una, una está diciendo. Sí, escucho, escucho. Ok. Eh, vamos a utilizar eh, distintas. Entonces, por ejemplo, el lunes. I get up early sí, on Mondays. Right? That's sí. positive. Something that I don't do, mm. algo que yo no hago, es I, I don't sleep late on Mondays. No duermo hasta tarde. I don't sleep late ah, on okay. Mondays. So o sea, you're going to do something puede, you do? Tiene, puede ser eh, variable la... Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Perfecto. Let's, let's start working here. ¿Entendemos qué dice cada una de las frases del vocabulario? ¿O les gustaría que vieran alguna de ellas? ¿Entendemos todas las frases? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, Jonas says yes. ¿Los demás? ¿Entendemos cada una yes. de las frases? O, no, yes. o, ¿O le gustaría que les diga qué significan las frases? Yes. 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 No, una duda, teacher. Sí. Uh, sobre el uso de on the phone, ¿cuál es la interpretación que se le da? Porque pues lo platicábamos la otra vez, pero on es sobre. ¿verdad? Ah, ajá. Talk on the phone es hablar en el teléfono, hablar por teléfono. Aquí on sería por. Pero por. Oh, uh -huh. Una variable. Okay, Talk gracias. on the phone. Uh -huh. I'm going to talk on my phone. Teacher, hey, ¿Sí? dinner late says. Dinner late? Por ejemplo, usted que está cenando hasta ahorita a las nueve y media. <ríe> Cenar tarde. Dinner late. Ah. Uh -huh. 
Padecimos. Ok. Eh, have dinner late. Yo se no tarde. I usually have dinner late. Usualmente como voy a bien tarde. Uh -huh. Y early significa temprano. I have dinner early. I eat dinner at 5 p.m. A las 5, si no, ya no sé. Uh -huh. okay. Have dinner late es en el tarde. Okay. Another one. Thank you, Carolina. Thank you, Van. Thank you, Carlos, for your questions. Another question. Yes. Yes, Nimia. Sí, eh, dice que lo que no logra entender es get up early. Uh, uh, I get up at 6 a.m. Me levanto a las 6 de la mañana. Get up. Get up significa levantarse. Okay, okay. Uh -huh. Pero de usted, que usted se levanta. Ok, por ejemplo, eh, Carolina gets up at 8 a.m. Ok, Entonces, pero it gets up de una persona. Very good, Nimian. Another okay. question. Tiene que tener como, como sentido una oración con la otra o no importa. No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. La primera fue chiripa. Uh -huh. <laughs> ok, ok. Tell me if you have questions, please. Teacher. Yes. Uh, I don't exercise on Thursday. Allí, eh, con no se le pone do ni nada de eso, sino que solo don't exercise. Mm -hmm. Because exercise is the verb, is the action. Mm -hmm. So exercise is when you work out, you know. Okay. So I don't exercise. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Did you finish? Almost. No, voy por viernes, viernes, miércoles. <laughs> ah, pues vamos el mismo día. Tell me when you finish. Teacher, ¿qué es si my friends? Sí. Ah, yo veo. Uh -huh. Ok, gracias. Visitar a mis amigos. Si my friends, visitar a mis amigos. Uh -huh. Ir a ver a mis amigos.
¿Verdad que van a hacer falta dos? Yeah, you can use the same from the top or you can repeat. Okay. Usar otro. Yeah. Oh, usar otro. Si este tema vocabulario, use su vocabulario. Finish. Finished. Okay, very good. Thank you, Joanna. Finished, teacher. Excellent, Karina. What about the others? Ready, teacher. Very good. Let's start sharing. Let's take advantage of time. Uh, Joanna, can you share what you have on Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday? Three days. Okay. Tuesday, I'll go to the school with my dad. Okay. And I don't drive a car because I can do it. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. And Thursday, I get up early and I don't have dinner late. And Friday, I play video games all day, so I don't see my friends. Okay, very good, Joanna. Excellent job. Very good. Now let's listen to Melissa. Melissa, thank you, Joanna. You did a great job. Share with me okay. Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Okay. okay. I get up on Monday. I get up early, and I don't go to my and I don't go to the church. Mm -hmm. And Thursday, I go to the church, and I don't eat early. Okay. Wednesday, I go to the place. Soccer. I go to play and soccer. I don't see movie at night. Okay. I go to play soccer. And I don't see movie at night. Play okay. soccer. Very good. I go to play. Mm -hmm. Very good, Talina. Excellent job. Very good. You use other phrases, right? Okay. Very good. That's great. Julio Carlos, what do you have? Wake up, wake up, wake up. Okay. And let's dig up. Tell me Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Okay. Wednesday, I sleep late on Wednesday. I don't um, pay dinner late mm -hmm. on Wednesday. Thursday, I check mail on Thursday. Mm -hmm. I don't talk on the phone on Thursday. Okay. Friday, I watch television on Friday. I don't go to school on Friday. I don't go to school on Fridays, okay? Very good, thank you so much, Julio. And let's see, who else? Who else finished? Who else? Carlos, you haven't spoken today. Okay, one moment, okay? Jessica, Carolina, Jani, Nemia, Nelson, Heriberto, Ivan, Daisy, Ana Daisy. 
What are you? Hello. Hi. Hi. Um, I watch television at 10 p.m. on Friday, but okay. I don't sleep uh, because at work. Okay. Because I have a work. I have to work. Mm -hmm. I, I have, have to, to work. work. Okay, very good. Tell me what, what do you have on Monday? I check email um, early on Monday because I check with um, okay. Uh -huh. with the meeting. For the meeting. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Heriberto, what do you have? Tell me Tuesday and Wednesday. Okay, Tuesday, I don't go to school mm -hmm. because I receive my class online. Okay. My English good. class online. <laughs> um, Wednesday? Wednesday, uh huh. Wednesday, I have dinner late. Dinner late. Uh, but I don't uh, eat my lunch at noon because uh -huh. my 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 hour my lunch hour is uh, after after noon. Afternoon, okay, in the afternoon. Yes. Okay, excellent. I like the vocabulary that you added. Very good. Very good, Heriberto. Now, who wants to participate? Who else? One more. One more for this activity. Okay, <laughs> yes, an applause, that's correct. Another one? Thank you, Claudia Yvette, for raising your hand. <laughs> Tell me two days, Monday and Tuesday. Okay. And then Ivan and Nest, okay. Hmm? I get up early every day. Um, Tuesday is, um, I check emails in the morning. Okay, look at the example, I check emails Right, in the morning on Tuesdays. Okay. Okay, look at examples. One more, tell me one more. Um, I see my friends the Sunday of afternoon. Okay, on Sunday's afternoon. Very well then. Tell me one, so, tell me something that is negative. Okay. Um, I don't exercise. I don't sleep early. Okay. I don't exercise when? Ever. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> I never exercise. Okay, good. Thank you so much, Claudia David. Ivan? Okay. Uh, Monday. Uh, I are drive on car for night on Monday. Okay. I don't I don't see me I don't see my friend on Monday. Okay. I place video on Friday. I don't sleep late on the Friday. On Fridays. On Fridays. Okay, on Fridays. Now, can you repeat the first okay, sentence? Re Repita la primera oración que leyó, por favor. Okay. I am I am driver of the car for night on Monday. Okay. I drive. I drive of car for night on Monday. Of car. ¿Qué quiere decir? Cuénteme. En español, digan. Sí. Uh, 
yo conduzco eh, carro por las noches. Okay. I drive um, my car at night. What? Okay. Ajá. You're going to say it like this. Or, eh, en este caso, para poder, para poder decir el día, se escribe on Monday or for Monday? On. Of, of Monday. On. Así on. como está en el ejemplo, sí. On Monday. Mm -hmm. I drive okay. my car at night on Mondays. I drive my car at night on Mondays. Okay? Change it. At, at night is, okay, okay, perfect. Change it, thank you so much. Okay, let's do another activity then. Okay. okay. Brenda Iris, do you have an example? Can I give an Brenda Iris? Um, I check in May every Monday. Mm -hmm. I don't exercise exercise on Monday. Okay, I don't exercise on Mondays. Okay, good. Excellent job, uh, Renaides. I sleep late on Saturday. I don't visit my grandmother on Saturday. On Saturdays, very good. Thank you so much. You use the grammar correctly. Very good, Brenda. Now, we're going to do this other practice. This is pronunciation, okay? This is not grammar. This is pronunciation. So we're going to pay attention here to the pronunciation, please. Pay attention. It says, listen to your teacher, so listen to me, right? We have a conversation between Janet and Cindy, okay? Janet and Cindy. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Fine, I have many things to do this week, but Katie is very busy. Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary. Her schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. And what does she do the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper. And on Friday, she arranges meetings. She is so busy. And on weekends? Okay, one more time, a little bit slower. Janet and Cindy. Good morning, Cindy. How Good are morning, you? Cindy. Fine. Good morning. I have many things to do this week. Fine. But Katie is very busy. Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary. Her schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. And what does she do the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper. And on Friday, she arranges meetings. She is so busy. And on weekends, okay, now I would like to listen to Janet is going to be Eriberto, right? And Cindy is going to be Joanna. Let's start. Okay. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Joanna? Sorry. Fine. I have many things to do this week, but Carrie is very bossy. Busy. Really? Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary. Her schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. And what does she do the, the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper. And on Friday, she arranges meetings. 
She's so busy. And on weekends? Yes. <laughs> Very good. Excellent job. Excellent job. Now we sure. got there. Yes? I have a question. Mm -hmm. What does it mean? Tick. Tick. The new secretary, the new secretary, her schedule is very thick. Very tight. 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 For example, in my schedule, I work from 7 a.m. to 10 p.m. Right? I only have one hour lunch because I am very busy. So very busy, it means that your schedule is very tight. So su horario laboral está bien apretado. Okay. Very tight. Okay. Good question, Eliberto. Okay, now, a schedule, a schedule, that is the most difficult word. Es la única palabra difícil que veo acá. A schedule, right? And busy, Joanna, busy. Busy. Busy, porque bossy es cuando una persona es mandona. Oh, you're so bossy. Bossy. Okay, this is, uh-huh, this is. What is busy? Busy. Busy. I am always busy. I have many things to do. Okay. Busy is ocupado. Busy is mandona. O mandona. Okay. Now, we are going to do uh, the following. Heriberto, choose one person. Joanna, choose another person. Jessica Rosemary. Hmm? Yes. Jessica yes. Rosemary. Jessica Rosemary. Okay, very good. Um, Brenda. Brenda, okay. Brenda. Jessica, you're Cindy. Brenda, you're Janet. Okay. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Fine. I have many things to do this week. Boss Kitty is very busy. Really? Who is Kitty? The new secretary, her um, schedule is very busy. In Thai, on the Monday, she he pardon, no, she she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the the product. And what does she she do? She does the other days. On the Wednesday, she sends some email, emails on the bookkeeper and on, and on Friday, she um, arranges meet. She is, so, she is so busy and on weekends. And on weekends? Okay, very good. Now, uh, please repeat with me. Arranges meetings, arranges. Everyone, arranges. Meetings. Arranges. arranges meetings. Jessica, arranges meetings. Arranges meetings. Very good, very good. Arranges meetings. Now, BC. BC. Repeat, Brenda, BC. 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 Exactly. Very good, very good. Now, choose another person here, Brenda, and you too, Jessica. Um, Carolina. Mm -hmm. Ana Daisy. Okay, Ana Daisy, which Carolina? Jenny Carolina or Carolina Yamile? Brenda, which Carolina? Okay. Um, good morning, Cindy. 
How are you? Fine. I have many things to do this week, but Kerry is very busy. Is very busy. Really? Who is Kerry? The new secretary, her school is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls, letters, she writes reports about the production. And what does she do the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some emails to to the bookkeepers and all on Fridays she arranged meetings. She is so busy and on weekends. Okay, please repeat with me, both of you, Daisy and Carolina, very, very busy. Very busy. No, very busy. Uh. Very, very busy. Very busy. Very busy. Very busy. Very busy. Very Katie. Busy. Katie. 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 Kitty. Kitty. Son gatitos. Chiquitos. Kitty. 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 <laughs> okay. So mish, 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 mish. Huh? Kitty. Katie. Okay. Katie. Katie. Now, Carolina and Ana Daisy. This is for everyone. Okay. Repeat. A schedule. 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 Very good. Schedule. Excellent. Thank you so much. Que están compartiendo. Ah, ok. Thank you so much, Heriberto. Thank you. Eh, pero no, no tienen que compartir ahí la, la encuesta. <ríe> pero muchas gracias. Eh, schedule. Repitamos esta. Later. 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 Production. Production. No. Listen. Production. Production. It's production. not production. 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 Okay. Ah, okay. production. Very good. Thank you so much. Production. Production. Yes? Puede, por favor, repetir el diálogo Segundo de Cindy, para la pronunciación. This one? Or this one? Segundo, por favor. Este? O yes. este? Este. Ese, sí. Ok. The new secretary. Her schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. Okay, one more time. Yes. Good? Okay, excellent. Now, do I have any volunteers to participate or we continue with the class? No? So let's continue. We have here Katie's daily routine. Ya leímos acá en la conversación. Right, all the things that Katie does. Cindy is telling Janet what Katie does, right? All the activities. So what are we going to do? We're going to have this table that is on page 21. It says Katie's daily routine. What does she do on Monday? What is the activity that she does on Monday? Tell me the activity. She makes. She makes. A lot of calls. She makes a lot of calls. On Monday, she mm. makes many phone calls. Yes, very good. So we're going to write here on Monday, she makes many phone calls. Okay. What does she do on Tuesdays? Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Look at the instruction. Also, Nothing. also, what other activities you think K 
Katie does in the other days of the week. Ahí, dice, ahí no dice nada. What do you think could be another activity, Joanna? Probably she drives at okay. her work. Okay, on Tuesday, she drives to her job, okay? Or to her workplace. Very good, Joanna. So that's what we're going to do with this daily routine. We're going to write there all the activities that they might do or not, okay? Vamos a utilizar el diálogo, right? Para llenar esta tabla. Las que no tienen, vamos a hacer lo que hizo Joana, que ella escribió otra actividad. Okay? All of the activities are at work. Todas las actividades son en el trabajo. Okay? Daily routines at work. So let's do it. Let's start working with this. Tell me if you have a question. Si no he tenido, por favor, díganme. Si tiene alguna pregunta. Schedule. A schedule. Teacher, can you put the other picture, please? Uh, yes. Está en su módulo. Está en su módulo, en la página 21. En su librito. Oh, uh -huh. ahí está. Uh -huh. Okay, let's do it, let's do it. Hello, Jenny. Hello. Hello. Me fui por un segundo, ¿verdad? Hello. Sí. Ok. Okay, we are going to call the attendance right now. Vamos a pasar la asistencia. En lo que ustedes trabajan. Let's see, Ana Daisy Fuentes Villegas. Present. Thank you. Eh, Brenda Iris Escamilla Pérez. Present. Carlos Roberto García. Present. Carolina Yamilet Hernández. Present. Claudia Ivette Samayoa Castro. Present. Eh, Denis Fernando Flamenco Nolasco. Emerson Adalberto Guevara Ortez. Present. Heriberto Antonio Alas. Present. Iris Elizabeth Salazar de Flores. Present. Thank you. E Iván Ernesto Elías. Jessica Rosmery Olmedo Fuentes. Present, Thank present, you. present. Julio Carlos Martínez. 
Present. Karina Melissa Estrada Aldana. Present. Milton Linares Molina. Nelson Iván Alfaro Flores. Present. Nimian Elizabeth León de Estrada. Vilma Beatriz Reyes Márquez. Jenny Carolina Martínez Alvarado. Present. Joana Beatriz Orellana Acevedo. Present. Okay, very well. So, we were putting there the uh, Katie's daily routines. Okay. ¿Encontraron alguna? Did you find any? What did you find for Tuesday, Julio Carlos? What did you write for Tuesday? A, your microphone. Perdón, no, no entendí si Tuesday or... Yes, Tuesday. 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 Okay. Um, she writes reports about the production. Okay, she writes reports about the production. Report, repeat. Report. Very good. Thank you so much. And what do you have, Heriberto, on Wednesdays? Okay, she's, she's, um, sorry. She's, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper and, um, mm. Okay, she sends emails to the bookkeeper. That's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's perfect. Ivan, what do you have on Thursday? Your microphone. Ivan, your microphone. Okay. What does she do uh, on Thursday? No mm -hmm. activity. Uh, on Thursday, uh, no activity. Okay. Uh, what activity did you write? Ah. Uh, okay. Uh, activity. Um, uh, no, es uh, día martes no le puse. Tuesday no, no puse nada. Okay. Lo demás día sí. Okay, y póngale una a usted con su vocabulario eh, eh, que tiene Tuesday. para el Tuesday. Tuesday. Uh -huh. um, ver. Uh, uh, answer the phone call. Answer the phone calls. Okay, very good. Answer the phone calls. Excellent. She mm -hmm. answers the phone calls. Okay. Nelson Ivan, what do you okay. have on Friday? It's answer. It's answer. 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 The mm -hmm. answer. Okay. Yes. Answer the phone. Nelson Ivan? Yes. Okay. Tell on me Friday. what what does she have on Fridays? On Friday, she has meeting. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Okay. Uh, tell me, Carolina, one more. What does she do on Tuesday? Your microphone. Carolina Yamilet Hernandez, what does she do on Tuesdays? Um, for the I I exercise. She exercises. In the trabajo. Uh, ah, no, no, no. But, ah, en sábado, sábado, sí. No, Tuesday, no Saturday. Ah, Tuesday, jueves. Eh, I, no sé cómo decir. Eh, I revisar agenda. Ella. Estamos hablando de Katy. She. Ajá, she. She. Checks uh -huh. the agenda. Mm -hmm. she? she checks the agenda. Okay. Okay. She check agenda. 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 Very well. Agenda. 
Now, we're going to stop here, guys. It's 10 p.m. I will see you guys tomorrow at 8 p.m. I will stay today just with Eriberto. The other ones have a beautiful night. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. See, you. Bye. see ya. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. This this finish? Yes. Okay. Bye bye. See you later. See you later. Hi, Eliberto. Eliberto, these ten minutes are a quick session. Just to know if you have any questions about the class, something that you haven't understood questions about the platform. Son 10 minutos para ver si usted tiene alguna pregunta acerca de la plataforma, algo que no haya entendido, alguna actividad que, se, eh, que, no, que no haya comprendido bien. Eh, ¿El micrófono? <risa> no, todo, todo está claro. Todo está claro, no tiene ninguna pregunta. No. ¿Cómo vamos con la plataforma? ¿Todo bien? Sí, ya. Creo que ya hizo todas las evaluaciones. Ya hizo todas las evaluaciones. Sí. El, y el midterm ya lo hizo también. Sí, ayer lo hizo. También lo hizo. ¿Cuánto se sacó? Sí. No sé si son 20 sobre 20. 20 sobre 20. Uy, se sacó 80. No. 25 ah. sobre 25. <risa> pues. <risa> ok, perfecto. Entonces, eh, cualquier duda que tenga acerca de las actividades, recuérdense que estamos ahí en el chat. Nos vamos a tardar tal vez un par de minutos en contestarle. ¿verdad? Porque estamos en otra actividad, pero siempre se les va a contestar. ¿Ok? okay. Sí, no sé si tiene alguna otra pregunta o algo más en lo que yo le pueda ayudar. No, de momento todo bien. Todo el momento todo bien. Ok, perfecto. Solo quiero ver sus, sus eh, notas antes que se me retire. Heriberto, 177. Solo la, le faltaría la Homework 3 y la Homework 4 y ya estamos bien. Va el día. Muy bien. Todo va <risa> súper, súper bien. Todo va con 100. Ok, perfecto, Heriberto. Entonces, eh, si no tiene ninguna pregunta, recuérdense que ahí estamos dispuestos en el chat para ayudarle. O si tiene preguntas durante la clase también. Ok, perfecto. Have a beautiful night, Heriberto. Gracias, igual. Adiós. Igualmente, adiós.